Yo, what's up guys? Keldew is your some tier back with another Pokemon Expanded deck, but today we're taking a look at Whimsicott V-Star from Brilliant Stars. So, this guy um, does the attack Trick Wind, um, 1 Psychic, 2 Colorless Energies, 160, but uh, you do um, a Pokemon Tool and Special Energy lock your opponent um, from playing those cards in their hand, which is which could be really good if you're if you're playing against like um, you know, a deck that only runs like special energy, something like, I don't know, like Bad Party or something. Also, the V Star is really good on this guy. The six damage to one of your, your opponent's, opponent's Pokemon for each energy attached to this Pokemon. So, if you have like five energy attached to this guy, do 300 damage. And then, yeah, you could, like, you know, kill a bench Pokemon uh, as well. So, that could be a really good, you know, just snipe. Um, we are also utilizing Gengar Mimikyu as, as a, another attacker. Gengar Mimikyu, I mean, kind of depends on the situation, but it can be pretty good at the beginning of the game. If they only have like one, just like any Pokemon that active, then uh, I mean, a lot of decks play a lot of trainers, right? So if you just you attach one Psychic Energy, you take another turn, and then yeah, you do 50 times the amount of trainers in their hands. So that, that could definitely do enough to knock out like a V or something. Uh, it could definitely do a lot more damage than uh, what Whimscott can, uh, can, can output. Um, but yeah, but if you have two energy attached to this guy, then um, you both players would draw until they have seven cards in their hand. So, I mean, the, I mean, yeah, you wouldn't be able to do that early game because it'd have to be like a few turns. But yeah, you'd want to do this, and if you want, if you want to give your opponent, you know, opponent cards in their hand, because um, I mean, just more chance they'll get some trainers in their hands, so you do more damage. But uh, this guy does is a three prizer, two hundred forty. <laughs> It's a 243 prizer, and then this is a 252 prizer. Which is, I mean, this isn't even a lot of health for a V-Star, but still. Um, but still, even if they kill like, a Gengar Mimikyu, they still have to go through like two Wimscott V-Stars or a Wobbuffet. Two Wims Wimscots and Wob or one Wimscott and Wob Wobbuffet. But we're playing four Wobbuffets. I mean, basically only for the start of the game. I mean, uh, what we're playing, I mean, be six, six, four, four. So like, yeah, like. 40% chance, I mean, you'll start with Wobbuffet, uh, which is good because ability lock your opponent um, as long as, I mean, if they don't play like a Psychic ability or something like a Tapu Lele or something, but pretty good just for slowing down your opponent, making sure we get um, a pretty good setup and, and they don't. So, um, yeah, I should probably go over this guy's attacks, the has got V, so it's actually just some basic Pokemon walling. Um, the defending Pokemon is a basic Pokemon that can't attack during <coughs> your opponent's next turn. Only does 20 damage, but this could be good against like all basic um, Pokemon decks. Um, just slowing down, um, you know, just stalling a little bit. But if they like retreat, yeah, they can obviously retreat and then they could attack on someone else, or they could like switch and retreat and then attack on the same Pokemon. So it's not like foolproof. Also, Cotton Guard 90 damage and then. Take third less damage. Uh, this guy is weak to metal, which I'm um, yeah, a lot, lot better than being weak to um psychic or dark or anything. But uh yeah, definitely gotta be careful getting Zassians, which is definitely not a really good match for this deck. Other Pokemon we have is Tapu Lele, which is good for getting supporters. So we're playing an all psychic deck here. Now you could possibly do these attacks as well, but moving on to trainers, we're playing one computer search. Got some hammers. We got a little bit of a hammers in the stack. Um, four crushings, and then yeah, a few for special energy. So um, for balls, we got four fog crystals, four treasures. Uh, fog crystals, good for basics and basic energy. Treasure can get anyone. You got to discard card from your hand. Playing tax, which which is a card you've probably never seen in any any, any other deck, but it's definitely kind of good with this deck because you can move up to two energy. For one tag team Pokemon to any Pokemon. So what this does, way to use this if you like use the Gengar Mimikyu, if you use the GX, and then next turn or the turn after, tag switch, move those two basic energies onto uh, like a one Scott V Star, because like other than we don't have much energy acceleration in this deck at all. So kind of got to use our energy attachments wisely, and this stuff is pretty good for that. Uh, but you can like leave one energy, you can like switch one, leave one energy on if you wanted to as well. 
Um, we got three males, um, <coughs> three V seekers as well. Silent Lab. So we got a, we got a really a lot of annoying cards in this deck. Silent Lab, Hammer, Special Energy Lock, Tool Lock, taking an extra turn. This this deck is um could be kind of full theme. Um, uh, supported plane, two Cynthia's, one Guzma, a few Marnies, one N. Marnie's definitely good. I mean, combination of like Silent Lab and stuff. Uh, playing four floats, which um, yeah, we definitely do a lot of retreating in this deck, so three or four floats definitely pretty good. Because uh, I mean, definitely want to start with Wob Fed, but if, if we don't, then trade a Wob Fed or retreat to Gengar maybe Q or retreat to the lot, lot of retreat goes on this deck. So, other tool includes a four seal stone, which I mean, is definitely decent if, if you're like really in a pinch and you need, need something. But if you use this, if you use this four seal stone, then you can't use the Wimps got to be star power. So yeah, you only really want to use that um, if you need to because this this V star is really is really good. And then for energy we got four DCs, which um, is good for this guy because you just need basically two energy to attack. But you can all you, you actually can't play this. Um, you can't attach to Ganger Mimikyu because you need you need psychics, but you can put on Lele. You could do some damage with Lele possibly if you attach that uh, as well as wild fit well oh yeah i didn't go through all of that's uh attack but i mean it's it's kind of interesting it's not really good but um it's something at least two two energy one psychic and then does 10 more damage for each damage counter on your opponent's active one yeah i mean yeah i guess you could like put dimension valley the, the original deck list didn't have dimension valley in the stack but i guess that wouldn't be too bad um, but I, you don't really need it too much. It'd just be kind of good for attacking with Wildfoot, I guess. But yeah, if you have like damage counters on your opponent's active Pokemon, that if you if you were able to kill, because if, if they have like 150 damage counters, then you do 160 damage, which is pretty good on a single prizer. So if you really um, want to attack with the single prizer, you could you could do that. That would, that would be a pretty good play. Um, but yeah, four DCs and then five basic psychic energy so that's going to wrap up um the introduction let's get right onto the battles all right going into the first game of the day we start with gengar mimikyu i'm going first so yeah, you definitely use his uh, abilities this turn oh wait oh no no yeah no i could possibly trip but no i can't but all right we're playing rapid or shifu so i gotta save one nah, <laughs> that's so troll i just talked like that guy but um I mean, yeah, I'll definitely want to get a one scan down. Should I tell I mean, yeah, I need to save this for the Lele for supporter, but I mean, I'll put on a one scan, I guess. This guy is weak to Psychic, so plus, I mean, he's definitely going to be playing Rapid Strike Energy. So maybe, maybe I just want to, like, yeah, get to this guy as soon as possible. That might be the play. Yeah, he's playing a lot of special energy, so I, I might not even need to worry about using this guy. Tool Jammer. Bro, that'd be really bad if you put him active, though. <laughs> Wait, what the heck? <laughs> Wait, why would he boss Swap that out? That's weird. Imagine if this guy wasn't a psychic type. That would be so funny. He did that. Why would he do that? I mean, yeah, I want, I want that guy there. So thanks. I mean, I guess. I mean, I, I got four floats. So, oh nice. I can end. Um, yeah, might as well hammer. I guess, but I'll just follow Crystal. In the, another one's guy. I'm, I'm gonna want. I mean, I probably won't get this turn, but either way, like, I mean, he's a ability lock, so that's that's good boss down did flow dc and then evolution probably not gonna happen not even close i didn't get any of them okay um yeah i'll just pass it's pretty bad end say so i hit one of the hammers then You got two Sylveons out. This 
guy did pull a tool during my active, yeah, that'd be um, a pretty troll. He's not putting any tools on, on his active though. All going on the bench. Escape rope. <laughs> really, dude? Um. I, I don't know, like, could he do any damage right here? I, he could. Um. I don't think I don't think he's gonna kill me. I mean, he could like possibly like, evolve this guy, but I doubt it. And he's gonna mark. I mean, I didn't really like my hand, but I could get a way worse one though. Okay, let's take him. All right, he's not gonna do much at least. He's playing basic grass energy. Whoa, I'll probably just end again. Um, yeah, I I, I need to get a DC. It's kind of pointless. I can like find a float eventually as well. That would be helpful. So he's got fruit. So he he did have the t okay. So that's kind of good. I put this guy because he does have the tool jammer. But now I can't really use the float. I don't play any few blurs. So all right, just give me DC and I'll, I'll be I'll be very happy. There we go. Okay. Still no floats. But yeah, he can't attach any energy now. So that's pretty good. It, it's 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 gonna be really slow for him now. Uh, I'm just gonna hold on to that. Uh, yeah, definitely. I'm just gonna play that. Yeah. So at this point, I mean, he's probably playing four rapids, four captures. Like, what other energy is he gonna be playing? He needs three to attack as well. He should be like severely, severely locked right here. He's playing a lot of grass for some reason. Who does he want to? I mean, probably, probably this guy, right? I mean, I, I guess I'll end again. Why not? Just keep like, a, keep um, yeah, just preventing that. Hopefully, I get a lap soon. Could like counter soon though. Okay, nice. There's a lab. All right, I'm getting really set up right here. Well, my point is not. So this is going pretty great for me. I'm just gonna save that V star. I definitely just want to keep doing this. Because let's say I put another DC, then I could do 300 damage. Which is a lot. I mean, that that, that still can't kill Sylvia on, on the bench, though. Or bench reacted, but that's definitely a lot. I, I have a Guzma, so I could Guzma this guy. Uh, and just one-hit this guy because of weakness. So we'll see. It's my path. So put this guy in the active. For what reason? Now it's gonna be hard for him to retreat. Ordinary rod. He's playing a lot of copies of Pokemon. Spiral energy. I mean, I'll just keep attacking. <laughs> just keep hitting, man. Should I bother to hammer like his dude on the bench? I guess I might as well. All right, I'll just keep hitting. Yeah, I, I really don't. I mean, what is it? What does Spiral Energy even do? But this this guy can't do anything. Bro is completely locked. Plus, he put it himself the past, so he can't even use that ability now. Interesting decision. So it can't be per okay. I mean, that's pretty useless. I mean, it's every energy though. But... <laughs> like, is there any reason for the basic grass? I don't see a grass Pokemon though. This guy can't attack for one thirty, and then I mean that's not great either. Though they get a lot of. I mean, no, he barely has any basic energy. It really wouldn't do much. So that that would even be. I mean, no, that would be to hit. But um, yeah, he sh he should have done that like five minutes ago. But I mean, let let's just see what he had in his deck. Twelve energy, four grass. Yeah, pretty. I don't know why I played spirals instead of two captures, but 
yeah, he couldn't do much. He could not do much at all. So definitely, uh, he was playing a lot of tools as well. Which yeah, I mean, if he had a, if he had one of these in a the sense, he couldn't use it because because of, of my locks. So definitely, definitely, um, yeah, kind of murdered that guy that game. All right, going into another game. So start with the worst possible Pokemon lately. Yikes! Uh, I'm going first, so I can still retreat to Wobbuffet or Gengar Mimikyu at least. So we are playing a uh, Decidueye deck. Uh, I got a lot of GX and Vs. Oh, Anchor too. The thing is, I have. I mean, actually, what could I do against that Bodhi? I don't know. But yeah, um, yeah. That means is even like playing abilities though. Maybe I should just. Whoa! Only one wind scott. Interesting. Yeah, I'm not even bothered trading honestly. I'm just gonna put this guy in the active, I guess. Yeah, decision is not good. I actually don't know what I'd do against that guy. Attack with Wobbuffet, but that's a really like slow attack. I don't think I can like snipe. Man, you probably start with the Bridget, dude. Really? Really, man? You gotta be kidding me. Oh, he's playing Rallic. Okay, well he's benched a ton of stuff, so it doesn't matter if he situation, but she didn't even get him. What the heck? Interesting. I was gonna idol mock man. That'd be uh, really fun. Like, dude, I, 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 all I saw was like a what, like a Dartrix or something. Yikes. Um, I mean, yeah, I could possibly snipe this guy, but there's, there's no point. It, even if I did get like the V Star, which I, yeah, I, I could kill him, but there's just no point because he could just auto do the same thing. So I'll just go for the active here. Actually, a pretty good hand though. I didn't get I, I didn't get any of them for the hand. What the heck? <laughs> okay. I mean, this is a pretty good thing to play, or a pretty good attack to do. So I, I feel like I yeah, I'm, I'm kind of looking good. So you can't you can't play any tools, so you can't even like float or anything. I, I did see special energy, so that's good. Oh well, he has a bird keeper, so I guess that's pointless, but. Yeah, I'm gonna need to use uh, use items eventually at, at some point. He's gonna put out. I could snipe this guy, but is that really worth it? So you get you give me a free knockout right there, and I'll definitely take the. So just put energy in that guy. Okay, well there there's there's a lot of items. <laughs> yeah, that that's uh there we go. That's what I'm talking about. Literally a handful of items then. <laughs> So, I mean, oh, this guy actually does a pretty, uh, does a lot of damage, though. Yeah, he does a lot of, he, he won't one in me right here, but it's going to hurt. So, I mean, I, I guess I probably, oh, really, Acerola? Okay, well, I'll probably just snipe this guy and just, yeah. But I mean, I, 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 yeah, I can't touch any energy next turn. But it's probably too late for him to do that again, which I guess is good. Uh, so I'll just do this and then, yeah, just use this V star, I guess. I'm gonna have to attack this guy because yeah, I got no energy on anyone else. This guy, yeah, does more damage for more energy, so... How are you getting so many Bridgets, man? Bro, there's no way he does the same thing again. That'd be really annoying. <laughs> Bro, that was... Like, come on, man, how? Is he playing for them, or what? That is pretty funny. Oh, wait, did he... Wait, Bench Bear, did he just put... Wait, did he have that down the whole time? Wait, I didn't even realize that. If I didn't put that lab, that would have been um, pretty sad. That would have been really bad. <laughs> I didn't even notice that, man. Yikes. Alright, um, yeah, I'll be just spam hammers now. Um, yeah, I need a fog crystal. He has a pretty big hand. He has a very big hand right here. 
If I land two hammers, then I mean, he can't attack next turn. I think Guzma, I'm not going to bother with that. Yeah, I definitely want to kill this guy, but nah, I mean, I'd probably do a lot of damage, but there's no way I'd, I'd kill him, surely. If I land one hammer, then he can't... No, he, he could retreat. Which is why I want to I land two of these. There's one. One more. Wow, okay. That's good. So... Oh, wait! I I don't have another Wimska. Er... Oh wait, I, I mean, yeah, I want to get Wimska here, but most of the energy, but... Yeah, what the heck, I have no Wimskats. I have two prized out of four. So I guess, screw that guy as attacker now. Interesting. Gara Wolf, yeah. <laughs> Going all out on Gengar Mimikyu, I guess, man. I actually have no other attackers. Um, I don't think I play Rescue either, so... Rip. I don't even want to use the splitter. No, I'm gonna hold this in. I could give him a whole new hand and then we both draw a ton though. That might be better. The thing is not, it'd be the same. I could give him a new hand. You know what? I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna give both of us a bunch of cards. I rarely ever, like, do this, though. Um, rarely ever, like, do the two energy whorehouse, but... Yeah, I'm just gonna reset his hand, because maybe, I don't know, maybe a lot of Pokemon is in or something like that. And then, yeah, I'll go for the hood. But yeah, I mean, there should be no way he could, like, attack me next turn, at least. I should just put energy on Wobbuff at this point. Because I could actually do a lot of damage on, on if I don't want to, I can do, yeah, you know, I will. Alright, let's see how much damage I can do. Three, four, five, I mean, what do you have? Weakness. Another, okay, so he does play a lot of bridges, but I don't, yeah, he can try to run with, with, um, Bird Keeper, but yeah, I do a ton of damage with Wallfit now. So it probably would be better if he did run, honestly, but I have floated anyways. He might like to set up Decidueye or something. But yeah, if I, if I kill this guy, then I mean, just one more prize I, I need. I still have like all my V-Seekers, I could just like spam Guzmas. But if he, if he does run, then I can't. I need another energy, so I, I couldn't do that. Or, oh, I should have been paying attention to how many trainers he had in his hand, because... Oh, he, he's not even around now. Does he have three? <laughs> Does he have three, though? I mean... Nah, you know, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna like, sit here, I guess. I'm just gonna, like, fully thin my deck out. I actually wasn't paying attention to what he had. I don't, I don't think he used a lot of trainers, though. Like, I think I would be able to clean him up. How many energy do I have? I only have... No, I could use a DC. Yeah, I really was not a pay, paying attention to that. Wait, I got four. He used... He only used one, though, right? I mean, should I... I mean... Okay, I, I'm gonna... Because um, all I have to do next is just, like, Guzma this guy into someone else. Right, I'll sit, yeah. If I get energy, though. Yeah, I, I think he has three in his hand, but I don't want to risk it. Just need one energy. If not, I guess I will be forced to hit. Okay, do I want a DC for this? For this deep? Yeah, because I have used a lot of psychics. I think I will. I have the Goosebumps as well. As I didn't hammer, so you could possibly attack next turn. Attack with Wob Fed. It's a lot of damage. Um, and then yeah, I mean, so let let's just say he has. I think he's still three in his hand. Okay, well, there's a Wimscott. That, that was so awkward. That were that there were two prize men. 
But yeah, it should be just good to use my dude on the bench. Another Bridget. <laughs> Bro, he still has 34 cards in his deck. Oh my god, I mean, that's what... That's what having no items... I mean, yeah, like, that's what item block does to yourself. Like, you don't play any items, so... That's pretty funny. Does he have a decision by him? Is he gonna item lock again? Bro, there's no way he's going for this again. Yep. Yep, he is. Okay. This is fine though, I mean. Um I mean should I use him this turn? So I do 50 times. He must still have like three of what would he what did he play that turn? Okay, so he has at least two, I think. I, I, I'm pretty sure he has at least two. I'm just going to put out like a Rowlet, I guess. Uh, no, this guy has two retreat, so I'll, I'll put out this guy. If this doesn't work, though, I like I might be um, I might be stuck for a while, but I just need to have, have two. Ain't no way this fails. Okay, so he did have two. Nice. Okay, that was... um. That was a game, man. Did he have, like, actually zero items? I didn't see a single one. I did not see a single item from him. He only had one Field Blower. Yeah, a, lot, a lot of these Relic decks, I mean, this was definitely a scuffed Relic deck, but... They have, like, at least, like, Nest Balls or something. Um, or Net Balls. But Pro had nothing. I mean, he pretty much just bridged all game. Uh, but yeah, de definitely... Definitely that attack doing doing bench damage though uh, was was really good for that uh for that relic but uh yeah kind of relied on or not relic but uh, that biopen but yeah kind of relied on uh, Gengar Mimikyu a lot for flat damage I mean mostly because I got two of these guys prized but uh yeah GG. Alright going into another game do start with a wooden sakat um right, I'm going second probably wanted like Gengar Mimikyu this turn. You get some from this trainer mellow. Gonna be two. This guy is weak to psychic. I could one and one with one scar V V star, which is pretty good, but he might play an Adrachi GX. Who knows? This guy only has 30 health. Oh, he's gonna retreat right. Oh, that might be a huge mistake, man. Oh no. That might be a huge mistake. Two V stars in my hand. Um right, I'm gonna have to yeah, get a Lele supporter though. Get the sand's gonna gonna trash. So I still need to get a psychic, and then hey, I do have this though as well. If I don't get a kick on my mimic you then get psychic. Then I could I could do the. So I'll just sit there right here. I mean, ooh, do I want to end? I could get one more card. Um, now nah, I'll just sit there. Okay, well, no Gengar Mimikyu. That is awkward. I'll just do this, though, I guess. Which, honestly, might be better. I mean, I, I probably would have won it. I mean, maybe. Probably would have. Because I just need, what, like, three trainers in this end. But, I mean, next turn, he can't attack. And then I can just DC, evolve, bam. Or never mind, because we'll do that. And Mart. Okay, bro. Okay. All right, man. All right. Um, I mean, I could still. Oh no, no, no I can't. <laughs> what is that hand? Why does he have so many shining muse? So he has no attackers, but he, he could use that GX though. Like, yeah, I could win him with with this, but he could still attack with this dude. I don't have the V star anymore. Oh, wait, no, this guy's not gonna do anything because all psychics. Um. Right, I'm gonna do this anyways, but yeah, I'm, I mean, nothing, uh, I mean, he could have something else in his hand, but he might have to. Because, yeah, I mean, whether this guy dies or not, then I can still do this next turn, use the GX, get a bunch of cards, so, and then probably one it. So, I mean, honestly, hopefully, hopefully he kills me. Hopefully he kills me here, because I'm coming right back at him. But if he got no one 
else in his discard then or bench. Why is he still stalling? Um, if he's still stalling, then I mean, oh wait, he has he has no trick cost. Huh? Just realized that. Uh, <laughs> uh, uh. Um, that's damage change. Don't like to see that, but does he have to rush GX? Because if if he doesn't, then I I can totally one at this guy. He's got a mute army. Seen nothing but mute so far. So he will. So what's he gonna do to? So he will. He will use his. I mean, I, not waste, but like he will use his GX on that. I mean, all right. Uh, there's a good chance I can one hit back, but I mean, who knows, man? Like a lot of these decks just play like 20 billion energy and then no trainers. But he has used a lot of trainers, which uh, is kind of a bad thing. Um, yeah, I'll send, yeah. I just need him to have three. Like, wait, what does this do? Oh, I thought that was like, uh, we started guarding gear or something for a sec, but. So that Silent Lab's pretty good. Alright, um, so I will give myself more cards. I might as well just use this stuff. For something. I don't know, maybe like just like a limb cut, I guess. He could dead or treat. What if he did that? What if he tried to run? You know what? I'm gonna. I'm gonna grab a goose if he tries to do that. Who knows? Yeah, let me let me do that. Oh wait, he can still attack, but no, he he can't do like any damage though, right? I totally forgot about that. He can still attack, but yeah, he just uses GX. He wouldn't kill one enemy anyways. And then yeah, he can he can scatter shop. It wouldn't be doing a lot. I mean, do I even want to play that? Yeah, I mean, I want to. I want to give him a few more cards just to be safe. So I'll, I'll give him two more cards by doing this. Let's see if he tries to run. I mean, that that'd be kind of funny. I need to get a one scout on the bench next turn. Okay, so he did do that. Can't use that ability though. All right, <laughs> he's not gonna like this, man. Like for sure, he has three in his hand. There's no way. Yes, I can get a Wimps Cut. Great. Let's get rid of N. Two of this. I mean, I might as well touch them. I'm not going to bother with this. Yeah, if I don't one hit, it, what what if I. Or. Nah, man. Like. Bro, there's no way I, wanted, I, I don't want this guy, let's be honest. Alright. Time for a Guzma. Guzma of death. Three. One, two, three, four. He has a Guzma and a boss in his hand. And a bird keeper. Okay. Alright, I just need two more prizes though. And I still have my V-Star, so like I can almost like snipe a dude if he puts something on the bench now. So he has no energy set up. That that is really good. Me too, Union. So I got yeah. I should pay attention to how many. So what? There's now three, at least three trainers in this hand. There's two now. So I I, I don't even have to trigger. I can just hit kill this guy easily. Bro, freaking X for sure. But dude, not bro. Him not having a draw GX makes this like really easy with weakness. Honestly. So yeah, I'll do that. Should I Marnie? Why not? Right? I'll Marnie because he still got what like um still has like a boss and stuff in his hand. All right. 
GG's, so dude, bro, dude, that guy had a ton of muse, man. Was there anything other than a Munis deck? Uh, I, I actually, no, I saw like, wait, no, I saw a, a Mew, yeah, <laughs> bro, I saw a, a Mew VMAX as well. Um, I don't know, was that just like a troll Mew deck? I mean, that was pretty funny. But uh, yeah, GG. All right, guys, that's gonna wrap up all the battles for this video overall. Um, yeah, definitely pretty decent deck. Um, it, it does really good, obviously, against like special energy decks. Um, it, it's kind, of, I mean, it's kind of got a lot of everything. I mean, Gengar Memory Cube can definitely do a lot of damage. Potentially, Whimsicott V Star doesn't do as much damage, but has the tool and special energy lock, which can be you know pretty good, as well as the 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 uh, the V Star. I mean, yeah, if you have like one psychic two dcs you're, you could do 300 damage to any any pokemon they have which is wicked which could be really huge that definitely was pretty pretty good in this um in, in the battles in this video but yeah i mean you could definitely struggle against like decks that have a, a lot of basic energy some of like rc's that like you know just gets a bunch of energy like real fast that could definitely be a struggle but uh yeah that's gonna wrap up uh this video if you guys did enjoy watching make sure you leave a like Subscribe to my channel. That's it, guys. Peace out.